This video will illustrate the proper way to prime the fuel system using a DACO FXP95. For Detroit heavy duty engines, set the pressure regulator to 95 psi, which is with the handle in the vertical position. Connect the green suction hose to the suction tube, which is designed to fit through anti siphon devices, and insert it into the vehicle's fuel tank. Remove the priming port dust cap and wipe the fuel filter module priming port clean. Dirt can cause the CompuCheck fittings to stick. Connect one end of the blue adapter to the priming port and connect the other end to the red pressure hose on the primer. Once priming begins, keep an eye on the vehicle frame mounted filter bowl. If the fuel level rises more than one inch, shut the primer off and diagnose an issue with the engine fuel filter module. With the priming tool set to the correct fuel pressure, Turn the priming tool on and prime the fuel system for a minimum of two minutes before starting the engine to ensure proper lubrication of the high-pressure fuel pump. After two minutes and with the priming tool still running, start the engine and run the vehicle at idle for one minute. After one minute, turn the priming tool off and increase the engine speed to 1500 RPM for one minute. After one minute, reduce the engine speed back to idle for one minute. Then shut the engine off. Disconnect the red pressure hose. Disconnect the blue adapter from the priming port and reinstall the priming port dust cap. Finally, disconnect the green suction hose and the suction tube. The fuel system is now primed. After priming the fuel system, an extended crank time is likely until one drive cycle is completed. 